Well, hello, YouTube. It's me, Tri-State EDC. Got a package. Got a package here from Nick Stasa23 here on the YouTubes. Follow him. Excuse me? If you don't already, hit him up. Blow him a kiss. Tell him Tri-State sent you. Hi. <laughs> it's too big. Let me zoom you in here. It's too cool, Big Daddy Coomer. That's me. Uh, and it's from Nick Matassa. That's him. Other than that, I know nothing. So, uh, let's, uh, let's, you know, come on, gang. We got a mystery to solve. <laughs> That's right, Mr. Nick. How you doing, man? Stasa23 here on the YouTube and on Instagram. Follow him. He's a sweetheart. Uh, he's a good guy. He's a sweetheart. Unboxing knife. This is the Dirk Pinkerton Contact made by... Uh, who was this made by? Beyond EDC. It's a great knife. Uh, amazing. Value for money. S35VN. Full titanium. Insane action. I like he. I like he very much. Nick, you're using those funky pants freaking... Uh, you UPS boxes on me? What is this? What? What is this? Oh! Oh, damn, boy! Oh, my God. Okay, hell yeah. Uh, I got the big old Stasa. Big old Stasa sticker in there. Is there anything else in there? Nothing left in the box. Get it out of here. Jesus. Oh, my. Oh, my. It's from freaking Knife Standards. First off, nice hard case. I love Knife Standards packaging. At this price range, you know, it's a nice touch. This is their new model. His, his, his new model. Oh, I'm jacked, dude. This is called the Station, I think. The RR Station from Knife Standards. This is his second design. Oh, baby. Oh, it's huge. <laughs> it's huge. Oh, yeah. This is the Knife Standards RR Station. This is the second design from Knife Standards. The first design was... Was this the RR Standard in MagnaCut made by Best Tech? Love it. I believe this is also made by Best Tech. But look at that. Full titanium build. Bolster lock going on. We got thumb studs. Look at the jimping here. Along the, the blade spine. Aggressive jimping. Super boxy, super blocky design. But clean. I had no idea it was going to be this big. Thank you for the patch, Stasa. You didn't have to do that. So, uh, size comparison. Hold on. Show you how big this thing is here real quick. There is a Spyderco Pair 3. Yeah. Yeah. Big in. And here is a Tactile Knife Co. Rockwall. Yeah, dude. That's a big knife. That's a big boy. Very girthy, too. Uh, I dig it. I dig it. Not crazy heavy, though, for the size. Nice milled titanium pocket clip here. Love to see that. F like, fat carbon? What kind of future mean? What kind of carbon is this? Gorgeous. Blue. Hued carbon fiber overlays that go over the uh, bolster there thumb studs a huge fuller let's flick it open dude let's flick it open uh standoffs no backspacer just simple standoffs pocket clip is reversible by the way nice touch prototype let's flick it open reverse flick oh yeah dude look at that blade oh huge hollow ground warning straight razor warren cliff Sheep, kind of a little bit of a belly on it. So sheep's footy. Sh I don't know what to call it. Future me? Modified sheep's foot? Modified Warncliffe? I don't know. Sheep's foot. Sheep's foot. Got the RR logo there on the squared pivot, which is a nice touch because it's a very boxy squared off knife to kind of follow that design language into the logo. I love it. So in hand, Ergo's huge knife. Fills the hand great. Feels really nice. Nice subtle chamfering all the way around. All the uh, edges are knocked down. Really well finished. So choke back. Smooth as silk, baby. It's like holding a stick of Philadelphia cream cheese. Feels great in the hand. Choke way back here. That feels awesome. No, and we got a nice finger choil right there. Sharpening choil, doing double duty. That feels great. That feels really nice. Pinch grip? Oh, yeah, baby. All day with the pinch grip. All day. Beautiful. Love the blade to handle ratio on this. That was one complaint a lot of people had with the RR standard was the blade to handle ratio was kind of off. This is not the case here. It's like a perfect 50 50 distribution. And I'm all for it. Beautiful. Got some internal milling to keep the weight down. Like I said, not crazy heavy. Action. Oh my God. Running on ceramic bearings. So reverse flick. Oh, money. Ah, that thing just closes. Thumb flick. Great. Oh my goodness. You can use the fuller. You got a flicking fuller. You don't even need the thumb studs. 
Wow, all the action's absurd. What? Oh, it's so good. I mean, that's a lot of blade, really thick blade stock here. What is the blade steel going to be on these? Future me? What's the blade steel on these? Uh, Pre-order for these is going on currently. It is open. Future me, how much are these? I don't remember. Uh, wow. Sorry, future me. Y thank you for everything you do. You're a good person. Maybe. Maybe you've turned evil. I don't, I don't know. Love this. Love this to death. Actions. Unreal. An absolute guillotine. Whoa. Can't get my finger out of the way quick enough. Acoustics. Nothing crazy. Woo. But satisfying, nonetheless. Oh, God, I love it. Like I said, beautiful belt satin finish hollow grind on this blade. Nice and thin and slicey looking. I'm betting you she'll cut something. So let me grab the phone book real quick. Let's see here. Oh, let's see here. Let's see if she'll cut. Oh, bro. Did you have any doubts? Did you have any concerns? I was not afraid. I wasn't even slightly worried. Absurd cutting performance. Super thin and slicey right out of the box. And this has been passed around to a few guys already. So, yeah. Oh, yeah. The RR Station. Knife standards. RR Station. Mwah. Chef's kiss. This is not the full review. Just first impressions. Uh, we ought to read the note. Uh, this will probably answer a lot of my questions that I had. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. In inspired by his dad's love of trains. That's why it's called the station. That's cool. Uh, uh, it's the second design. They are our station. This version you have is aqua. Classy. Uh, one more. He says changes. One more piece of jimping on the blade spine. Okay. Uh, extended thumb stud length. Honestly, they're kind of okay where they're at. So, but that'll be nice. No disassembly for this one. Blah, blah, blah. Blade steel. Hollow ground Vanax. That's right. It's Vanax. The blade steel's Vanax. Hollow ground. Yeah, I'm all in on this one, dude. I'm all in on this one. Links for this down below, as well as links to his Instagram. Be sure to check this out for yourself. I'm in love with this. I will have one. I love my R standard, and I like this more just because of that blade shape and Vanax. I love Vanax. So that is it from me. Thank you all. Uh, if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe, leave a thumbs up, leave a comment. Let me know what you think about the RR station here. I, I'm a big fan. I'm a big fan. Okay, Tri-State approves. Tri-State approves. Become a channel member. Become a Patreon member. Hit me up on Instagram. Plenty of pictures on Instagram and on Kara's Instagram, so check us out. But that is it. Thank you all oh so very much for watching. And until next time, bye-bye now.